Eric Money and Ron Town is um, they you know they had a case and then they had to go to court. So they win their forty million dollar case for Ron Town. So mm. basically, some company sued them about two or three years ago for not coming for an event. And um, the judge was saying from the whole evidence and the whole narration from point A to point B, they were saying this is a case of you not meeting up your own side of the agreement. Mm -hmm. You did not book a flight for <clears throat> Run Town to be there. You did not make necessary arrangements in time. Mm -hmm. And you just expect that because you have made a particular amount of payment, he just has to be there, whether he flies or crawls or appears or even faces security issues. Mm -hmm. So what do you have yeah. to say? So, um, I think it's, um, it's a fair verdict that um, the judge made on, um, on this case because at the end of the day, when you're inviting this artist mm -hmm. to come and perform at your event here and stuff like that, you need to make sure that um, adequate provisions are made, made for them such as security, like you spoke about, accommodation, transportation. transportation, things like the basic things you need to do. So if you are not meeting up to your own end of the deal, so I shouldn't be blamed for coming late. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? If, um, okay, there was a, a company that sponsored Bonner's show yesterday. So imagine they say, oh, we don't want you late there, so we're going to get you a chopper that will drop you on stage. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. And then at the end of the day, they didn't provide the chopper and Bonaboy was late. Do you mm -hmm. understand? So mm -hmm. it would be because of their own negligence. Not so, because of Burner Yeah, Boy. not because of Burner Boy. So I think, yeah, it's a fair verdict. And um, this is very surprising that, um, they, well, it's because they're involved, you know? Right now, they're having issues. They're mm -hmm. still having legal. You can remember the general. Yeah, even when I saw when I saw the headline, I thought it was something against Ron Town. Town and and I read the, record, the yeah. story. So I think it's something uh, Empire of uh, what 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 do they call themselves again? The name did not stick. Yeah, I <laughs> <laughs> it did not exactly stick. What they call but them, um, so, yeah. I'm I'm happy for them, and I just want to say if you're signing an agreement, because most of it, these artists when they agree to come on your show, there's an agreement that you sign. So you mm -hmm. need to read through and look through their terms and conditions yeah. and be sure that you're ready to meet these terms and conditions before you wake up to say, oh, they did not come through for me or I did not come through and for them. And they were suing for 14 million naira in damages and mm. they were not able to prove beyond reasonable doubt what the 14 million naira was for. Because if you're suing and damages, then you have to say, okay, I lost... Uh, my f the the people that were supposed to come and watch the show, they had already paid. We had to refund them yeah, their money. money. You know, mm -hmm. you have to give. So you didn't prove beyond reasonable doubt that okay, this is why we're suing for fourteen million naira. So I think that's, that's why they need the someone like you in their camp. They they were. Trying. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's part of the reason why the case was um, dismissed as well. So mm. um, I'm happy for Ron Town and um, the Eric, Eric Money family. Yeah. So. <laughs>